G, I, I will just tell you, if you're not ordering this right now, I don't know what's going on, because if you've always wanted to have your own personalized pizza oven, Wolfgang Puck, the man, the legend, is gonna make it possible for you today. We're celebrating 25 years with uh, Wolfgang. I've known him for at least that long. I've been to his restaurants, I've been to Spago. He even let me behind the line, let me cook mashed potatoes with him at Spago many, many years ago. But leave it to that man to create a home oven, a pizza oven that is not only gonna give you incredible results, but we're gonna do it at an affordable price. Cause I don't know about you, them big brick ovens, you got seven, eight, nine, ten thousand $10,000. Those dome ovens, the Italian ones, you got 20, 30 grand. I don't have that. If you got 199, you can get the most incredible oven. And here's what I love about it. Nothing to plug in right? You simply put the wood pellets in, you light them up, and it'll get up to 950 degrees in 15 minutes. And anybody that knows anything about pizza knows that the key to a really good pizza, you got to get that oven temperature up. You don't want it to cook long because you want your dough to be soft on the middle, but crispy on the outside. This is the way to do it. Let me tell you what you're going to get, and then we'll get over to Wolfgang and we'll start doing some cooking. So everybody that orders has their choice. We have it available in the black, or we have it available in the stainless steel. All right, it comes with everything you see here. There's a little chimney, the pellets go in the back, you light them up, 950 degrees in 15 minutes. That's what's gonna give you the crisp. That's what's gonna give you the crust. What's gonna give you some of the flavor? The pellets, all right? We have the pellets available. You're gonna get a starter pack of the pellets, but you also are, you're not getting a starter pack of pellets. You can purchase the pellets to go along with it. We've got these wonderful bags and different flavors. You just put a scoop in the back, light it up, let the oven heat up, you're good to go. In addition to the oven, we're also gonna give you the peel. This makes you, gives you that professional pizza guy look, right? Get in there, take your pizza off, okay? You're gonna get the double-sided uh, stone um, grate at the bottom. It's got the, the one side, is gonna be for like roasting vegetables, things like that, and the other side, that's your pizza side, okay? And that's the one that's gonna help to absorb some of the moisture. You're also getting the thermometer to go along with it because you wanna make sure you have the exact temperature uh, when you're good to go. So if you tried to pick up all this stuff separately, oh, by the way, there's a cookbook that comes with it, it gives you ideas. If you tried to pick it up all separately, you're talking over $400, $437.43. If you pick it up with us today, the flex pay on this, are you ready for this? The flex pay is less than $50. In fact, the flex pay, what does that say? $39.98. Lastly, get a brand new HSN credit card. We'll take $40 right off the top. You spend $159.99 on this. It's an incredible deal. Let me introduce you to the incredible guy who I've All known right. for a long, 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 long time. My friend, it's good, good to see you. Good to see you. And let me show you show one me, thing, show how me. easy it is yeah. to make it. Now, this you can take anywhere. You know, look at that. You can lift it up. 20 it's pounds. not heavy. Yeah. The thing comes off. The chimney comes off. So if you want to take it somewhere, put it together, just like that, so easy. And if you want to turn it on, you put that out, all right. Tighten it. Tighten it up, yep. put it back in here, and that's it. That's then, it. come over here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you how it works. Here we have our pellet, mesquite, charcoal, whatever you like, you get. And then, you also will get the little kindle, the fire starter here. You put that right in here, and with matches or a little lighter, you light them up. It's hard to see here if the fire is on. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it is. There you go. So There's, look at that. See so that? you got a little fat wood right in there. Yep. Yeah. So a little piece of wood in here, and that's all you have to do. So now I'm going to put it right into my oven, and it will start to burn the, the little pellets, and that's it. That's it. And then... You don't have to take that out. You refill it through the top here. So if you want to put more pellets in here. Yeah. You just put them right in. Yeah, you put them right See, in from the top here. On my smoker, I got to take everything out to yeah. put more charcoal in. It's yeah. a pain in the neck. Yeah, Not this, this is so simple. Yeah. And then I'm going to show you one more thing. Where is my little uh, gun here? OK, so you look the right temperature. You can see here it is. Okay, yeah, it's 700, <laughs> 700 degrees, so we are good. So now, you decide what you want to put on the pizza here. Maybe some tomatoes. Maybe it's, it's can, can we turn that off here? Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll just turn it that way. Yep. Yeah. So you got some tomatoes on I got there. some tomatoes, and you know what I like to? A little bacon. 
Ooh, I like that, like Good. that. Whatever so, you want, right? Yeah, whatever you want. Yeah. Maybe put on some sausage here. Sausage, bacon, tomato. If you want a few leaves of oregano, fresh one, dried one, it's all up to you, okay? And then all you have to do is put it right in our oven here. And what do you have, a little cornmeal on there to uh, slides? Yeah, cornmeal or semolina. So how long, Wolfgang, in well, there? You know what? It is so fast. If you don't watch it, it's like my big pizza oven at the restaurant. So don't walk away. Yeah. Oh, look at that. See that? Put it right in here. Look at that. And you can count. In two minutes, you turn it, and then one more minute, and the pizza is done. I love that you can see the flame in there. You can yeah. see that smoke. And that smoke is giving that pizza an extra level of flavor that yeah. is unbelievable. Totally. Just like in yeah. our restaurant. You yeah. know, Spago is famous for its pizza. So is all our restaurants in the airport, you know. Yeah. People come for the pizza. Why? We make our own dough. You know, it's flour, olive oil yeast, a little salt, and a little touch of honey. So, uh, By the way, the dough is available in a yeah. four pack if you wanna get the Wolfgang Puck dough. Uh, we'll put the item number up for that as well. That is available, which I encourage you to get. If you wanna make pizza, dough's half the battle. Yeah. We'll let Wolfgang help you. And this is so easy because it's measured for you. Now let's look in here because we cannot forget it. See that? Oh, look at that. Look at the fire it's in here. It's almost there. Yeah. Wow. Why is it the temperature so important, Wolfgang? Well, the temperature is so important because you want to have the crust outside nice and uh, crispy yeah. and chewy inside. Okay. So it's so much better when you cook it that way. And then, if you don't want to stretch it, you can roll it out with a rolling pin. But this dough is so perfect, it's easy to stretch. Look at and that. you get that pizza bottle with it too. So you put semolina on here yeah. or, or just regular flour if you want to. All right. And then we're gonna put our pizza right on top. Oh, this is so. so this is like this. You do this at a party. This is so much fun oh, to do. You're right? in the back, in, the, in your backyard, oh or my wherever gosh. you are. Let or everybody make their own pizza. Exactly. <laughs> wherever you can have a barbecue, you can have your oven. Oh, the pizza. We have to turn it. Look at this. Yeah. All right. Remember, it only takes about a minute and a half to two minutes. Yeah. So you don't want to you don't want to sleep on your pot. Look at Look it's at already that. getting see, there. See that? Now you're gonna give it a little spin. So you give it a little spin, get a little tongue or a little spatula, turn it around because okay. obviously the fire is in the back. Just the way we also do it in our pizza oven, we yeah. have to turn it. Okay, close it back up, and in no time, you're gonna have the pizza ready. Another 30 seconds. I love the fact that we can make whatever style pizza we like, if you yeah. like vegetarian, if you like meat pizza. But remember, you can roast wings in here, you can do the best roasted smoky vegetables. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh, so delicious. All your favorite toppings, and fraction of the price when you think about it. Think about taking this camping, yeah. barbecue, exactly. church picnic, you wanna open up your own little pizza stand, you can do people, that. People, you know, for this school, you have kids in school, you take that for the school, and yeah. people are gonna say, oh my God, where did yeah. you get that? This is amazing. I have a little fresh mozzarella oh, here too. Oh, fresh mozzarella. All right, <laughs> and then, if you want vegetables, I roasted the vegetables here in the pan, as so you, you can see. So you did the veggies in the oven too? In the oven, yeah. Look at that. And Marianne was making scrambled eggs for us for breakfast. I gotta make scrambled pizza. I like that. Hey, you can't go wrong. I mean, yeah. you could put pretty much anything on a pizza dough, and it's gonna be absolutely delicious because you get that smoky exactly. kiss of flavor on there. Yeah, so now, if you like pesto like me, a little pesto is always good, okay. and if you like spicy, put a few slices of jalapeno hey, on here. Wake look up in the morning, you gotta get kick started. With yeah, a little, I know, here, <laughs> look at peppers. that. All right, here we go, we're putting here another we one in. So this one is this almost one, done. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, gonna take it out in a second. Nope. I got you, Wolf. You got it? There you go. Yep. Okay. All right, let's put the next one in here. Look at how we're not wasting any space. It's yeah. the perfect size for a 12-inch pizza or smaller. If you want to make a 6 or an 8-inch pizza, you can do that. So what's going on in there is we're trapping all that heat up to 950 degrees. That's what's crisping, that's all what's right. melting, and that smoke. Now, look at let's that pull here. this pizza out, then we'll tell everybody what they're going to get one more time. Look at this. Oh, Wolf, Wolf. Look at that. It's perfect. Come in close, get right down in there. Look at the bubble, look at yeah. the sizzle. 
all come to light. And that's smoky, I can smell that. Yeah. Kiss of smoke. Absolutely. So this is really an amazing pizza. You serve it just like in our restaurant. Marianne, you're gonna when are you gonna cut that pizza up? Right now. When are you gonna cut that pizza up? All right, well, Marianne is doing that. And uh, and by the way, Wolf, we don't need to, can we eat it right away? Should we let it settle or just go? I I, I just eat it right away. Perfect. I cannot wait. Nobody no. waits, you know. If you put the pizza out, you cut it into <laughs> slices and that's it. Look at this pie. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let it cool for a sec. Yeah. I'm gonna come over, they want me to show one more time. Okay, show them what people get. I All mean, right. it's amazing. Here's your choice, okay? I'm actually, the one I'm gonna buy today, I like the black. I like that black finish on there, so I'm gonna get this one. It's kind of a modeled finish. Three to one, people are ordering that. Or you can get the stainless. You get, obviously it has the oven door. You get the two-sided baking sheet. Now remember, this is ceramic. It's got, a, it's got a polished side on one side for your roasted vegetables and things like, you know, sausages, things that might be, uh, you know, whatever it is, bacon, whatever you're cooking in the morning. And then the other side is the pizza side. That is not coated because that's gonna help to absorb the, most, the moisture and get that crisp crust. You're also gonna get the peel. The pizza peel is the key. Put a little cornmeal, a little semolina, as Wolf said. Put your pizza on there, slide it in the oven, shut the door. 10 minutes, you got a pizza, all right? Not 10 minutes. Two minutes, you got a pizza. If you're doing frozen pizza, it's about four minutes from frozen to done. We're gonna give you the, the book with some cooking ideas. If you come over here, if you want the pizza dough that Wolfgang is using, I'm telling you, get his pizza dough. The best pizza dough I've ever had, okay? It's delicious. And we have the pellets. And we have the pellets in, in a variety of different um, flavors, I'll say. I know, we have, uh, I know we have mesquite. I think we also have, what are the other flavors that we have in that, Rob? I think we also have, I wrote it down somewhere in here. Anyway, you can see them on .com, but we have those available for 39. Stock up on the dough, stock up on the pellets. So all you need to decide is do I want black or do I want the stainless steel? But get it home. It is so much fun to have a pizza oven. And you know what? I thought about getting a pizza oven for a long time, but I'll be honest with you, they're expensive, all right? You go online, even something even similar to this is gonna cost you six, seven, eight hundred dollars. Yeah. We're doing it at $199. If you try to get a restaurant style dome oven, you're gonna spend 40, 50 grand on those things, right? Yep. And even the big Blodgett deck ovens are fifteen, twenty thousand dollars And if you wanna turn it on, you have to start early in the morning to heat it up. I, I have one wood burning oven. We start really early in the morning yeah. at eight to turn it on and by noon it's ready. I heard the people at Pepe's they, they had to put it on the day before. It's gotta be on for like a week before that <laughs> thing know. gets hot, right? Yeah. So look at that. Our pizza is in. Hey, and the nice thing about this, Wolf, you yeah. spend less time cooking and more time enjoying. Exactly. Right? And it's fun doing it while you're with your family. And look, don't forget to get the dough, you know? You can make the pizza dough. If you have a mixer, a food processor, whatever it is, you can make your own dough at home, and it's the best one. That's the dough, the recipe we have at Spago, which made Spago famous. Oh, uh, that, that, which is my favorite. I've had yeah. that. Your smoked salmon pizza is yeah, ridiculous. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, if you'd like to order right now, the quickest way to do it is to get your phone out, take a picture, or just hold your phone camera in front of that icon that's at the bottom of the screen. There it is on the side. Yeah. Take you right to .com, and you can order right away. This is the dough that Wolfgang is uh, offering you as well. Yeah. You get a four-pack of the dough. So I want to make a pizza. Show me how to make a pizza. All right, now look at that. Okay. So, so easy. So you make the dough, you let the dough rest, and then you stretch it. It is okay. the simplest thing. Yeah, it's perfect. Nice look and soft. That. Yeah. Uh, okay, oh my God. We got yeah. another one ready. Okay, Mary Ann. Take it, take Mary it out. Ann. <laughs> All right, great job. Okay, <laughs> look at that. Oh, you made a pretty one. That's it's a pretty the one. egg one, the <laughs> breakfast <laughs> pizza. Look at it. Yeah, it's like a Christmas breakfast pizza. It's got all the great colors yeah. on there. It's got my name on it. Hey, Mary Ann, can I take a taste of that one you yeah, did right before? There. There's a little one. All right, here we go. I got it. I got to try this. Okay. Here you go. Can you see the piece I'm going to eat right here? Look at this piece. Bacon, sausage. Do you see it? It's dripping. Look at that. Delicious. All right, here we go. Oh, my We're God. We're so lucky, aren't we? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Wolf. Yeah. The crust. Yeah, the it's crunchy a, crust. It, yeah, That's it's what I perfect. Love. Yep. Oh, my God. All right, so what are we making? All right, let's make one, a traditional so one. Good. So I'm gonna put a little olive oil on my mm. dough here. Mm. And then cheese, mozzarella, fontina. And you know, one of the favorite pizzas we do too at the restaurant is the barbecue chicken pizza. Now that's great because you have leftover chicken, let's say at home. Yeah. 
And then all you have to do is use some barbecue sauce, <laughs> mix it with it. What are you putting on there, barbecue? Barbecue sauce. Oh my gosh, look at this. See, only by your imagination. Whatever yeah, you got, ex you could have leftovers. Yeah, exactly, that's mm -hmm. perfect. You have roasted chicken one day, and then the next day, you go outside and with the leftover, you make your barbecue chicken. Look at that, look at that. So if you've got anything in, I mean, literally anything left over, if you've got some roasted cauliflower, yeah. right? Maybe you got some peppers and sausage that you made earlier. There's some nice sausages. And remember, you're not just making pizza in here. You're making roasted vegetables. How is my sausages. steak in there? What? Do you, oh, you do steak in there too? Yeah, I, exactly. Well, a lot of the best restaurants broil their steak anyway, but yeah. you're gonna get that smoky flavor. Yeah. What you got, Marianne? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Ooh, it's getting there. It's not there, but yeah. yeah. Look at that. Wow. By the way, if you want that grill pan, hey Rob, you want to put the item number? Oh, look at Rob, right on it. Twenty-two ninety-five. I would get that grill pan automatically because you're going to go want to roast yeah. veggies. You're going to want to cook other things. All right, look at that. Here's my barbecue pizza, chicken pizza with the little roasted peppers and onions. All right, set and your timer. Yeah. Two minutes. <laughs> Two minutes to pizza. <clears throat> so what's going on in there, Wolf? We got the smoke, we got the heat, we yeah, got the fire. Can, yep, <clears throat> look in there. You can see the fire in the back of the oven, just oh. like at my huge pizza oven at the restaurant. Hey, if you want to get it home, 39 yeah. bucks gets it home. Yeah. I buy it. Look at that. That is awesome. You know, two pizzas for the price you pay for, for one flex payment. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You get the pizza. It's Spargo a pizza is $28, so it's $56 for two. And pizza to make yourself is so, uh, yeah. so cheap. It's yeah, not expensive. Exactly. If you get Wolfgang's dough and just get some fresh produce, some fresh veggies, fresh basil, whatever it is you like on a yeah. pizza, it gives you a whole nother way. You know, I love it because it's a whole nother way for you to cook. Exactly. It's exciting. And yeah. it's so much fun. Yeah. You know, I know my kids love it. Everybody loves it uh, my, to my play son, in the backyard. Yeah. My son would flip out yeah. with this. He'd be like, Dad. Let's have a pizza party. I know. I mean, like, all right, let's go do it. And you can do it, and you can save money doing it because you're eating at home. You're having fun. It's springtime. Get outside. Yeah. Remember, this is an outdoor oven because it does have the pellets. But what I what I love about it, too, is that, and Wolf and I talked about it ahead of time, you could take this anywhere you go. Exactly. Camping, church picnic. Maybe your kids want us, instead of lemonade, they want us a pizza exactly. on a quarter. Yeah. A dollar a slice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you sell them by the pie, by the pie, no slices. <laughs> All right. All right, look at that. Almost done, almost ready to turn around. That's half the fun looking inside, yeah, isn't I it? Know. It's so much fun to look at. And all you do is put the pellets in the back so the hole, so it's so simple, so easy. Let me show you one more time. Yeah, keep going. You I can watch to... you make pizza all day. Okay. <laughs> so you have the dough here. Take the dough out of the refrigerator if it's refrigerated, and okay. then with your two, with your hand with three fingers, make it the shape right away. So you can see I have the lip here yeah. of the pizza. Okay. Be sure to always have enough flour on it so it doesn't stick. And then with your thumb, see that? Yeah, it's stretching. You stretch it. You don't need to rush this part. Yeah. This is the, this is the part. Exactly. Take your so, time. And then you can stretch it with the back of your hand. See that? So nicely and elastic. So perfect dough. So if you get our doughs, our flour mixture and everything, look at that. <laughs> All right, I'm buying the black one. I don't know about you guys, but I, I'm a foodie. Wolfgang knows that. I, I, I tell you, I love to cook. You know, I, w I, I worked in restaurants to get through college for years and years, and, and I tell you, Pizza ovens are expensive. Go online and try to find oh, a pizza can we, oven. Can we put that away over there? Wolfgang can Pop we put the fan away there? Yeah, we're, I think we're just trying to keep the flies out of here. Because, uh, you know, okay. they smell uh, the food, and uh, they are, they're all coming all over the place. <laughs> they are no dummies. So no, okay, they good. aren't. They smell good food. All oh, right. But if you want to get it home, it's only $39. And okay, by the way... Okay, you look at my pizza, Marianne? Hey, there? Rob, put up the uh, HSN credit card offer. If you want to get this for $159, yeah. $40 off today, you become a, a HSN card member, you get $40 off, so use it on the pizza. So we're gonna do another okay, pie. Okay, I'm gonna make a pesto pizza here. Okay. Okay, look at that. A little mozzarella for sure. dinner cheese mixture. You also can add a little bit of parmesan. If you love parmesan, makes everything taste better. So make a four cheese pizza if you like to. And you know, the kids always love pepperoni. Always, yep. Every time. It seems, seems <coughs> to me it's everybody's favorite is 
Oh, every kid's favorite is pepperoni. Pepperoni, or they eat grilled cheese or chicken fingers. Yeah, or plain, <laughs> plain cheese. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and by the way, if you don't want to use cheese, if you have lactose, whatever, yeah. you can make just a roasted veggie. See, the key is with that smoke, you're getting such another level of flavor yeah. that you wouldn't get from just putting it in your so own oven. You cannot cook it in your regular oven yeah. just like that. How is the steaks? Yeah, you're ready, and so are the bratwurst, but you're ready here. Okay, good. All right. By the way, that's Chef Marianne over there. If you hear Marianne chiming in, she's helping us out because we've got a whole bunch of stuff going on. Now, if you love sausage and peppers. I know. Oh, my God. Look at it. Oh, oh. And you know what's nice, too? I don't have to wait 45 okay. minutes for look my barbecue at, at to that, heat yeah. up, right? Yeah. Look at the sausage. With the roasted onions, oh peppers, and everything. So Where's my perfect. hoagie roll? I know. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Yeah. Perfectly cooked. And now, those nice are... Nice and crunchy on the outside. Yeah. Look at that. And by the way, those are cooked in the uh, grill pan. Yeah, thank you. Rob will put up that grill pan. I gotta buy the grill pan, I gotta buy the pellets, and I gotta get the black oven. That's what I'm gonna order when I get off work. If you wanna get this, if you're sick and tired of the same old food, if you're tired of waiting for pizza in a box, yeah. that is never gonna be as good as pizza out of the oven, because what happens, you put it in a box, it gets soggy, right? Crisp, okay. melty, what you got, Wolf? Look at that. We made a steak. You saw me put the steak in with yeah, yeah. some vegetables. I almost forgot it, too. All right, thank God I have Marianne here. <laughs> so now if we have a steak, we cook it, we let it rest a little bit, okay? Oh, look at that, with some peppers. <laughs> look at that. Gorgeous. Yeah. So you're not limited just to pizza? No. So you can roast in it perfectly, you know, if you want to have something fast, a pork chop, whatever, and it just comes out always delicious. I just love that I have another way that I can cook, right? It's not your standard oven, it's Ooh. not your barbecue grill, which takes forever to heat up. It's not having to buy charcoal. You don't have to plug anything in. This is Look a self-contained. It goes so fast, you really have one. to watch it. Look at it. All right, Mary. This I'm, is my barbecue chicken pizza here. I might have a slice of that too. We did yeah. have that okay. pepperoni. There's so many beautiful pies out here. And what you're gonna notice, we've only been on air 15 minutes. Wolfgang's already made one, two, three, four, five, six, six pies already. Yeah. In 15 minutes. You really, you gotta understand, the only way that a pizza place can make money is to cook pizza fast. Luckily, that's the best way to cook pizza because you get a great crust on the bottom and you melt. But the average pizza oven, most pizza ovens that don't have wood fire, they get to be about six or 700 degrees. We're yeah. talking up to 950 degrees, Walt. Exactly, wow. exactly. So now look at that. I like my crust nice and crispy and Me dark, too. so. Me too. Extra char. Yep. Extra char. And look at that. Look at I mean, this. it could not be better. You oh. do that at home, eh, people are gonna come over and say, oh my God, look at that. Look at that. They make the best pizza in this household. So. Look at that crust. Well, can I, yeah. do you mind if I show them the bottom? Yeah. Look at the bottom, all right? Everything cooked perfectly. A little yeah. bit of a char. If you like it extra crispy, just leave it in a little bit longer. Yep. But remember, the time to eat pizza is when it comes out of the oven, right? Yep. Not 30 minutes after it's cooked in a box. But, so. yeah, if you want to make a lot, if you have 20 people over, you can make them half cooked in advance and then just pop them in the oven one after two, one. Two minutes a pie. Yeah. I mean, you could make, literally, in 20 minutes, you can make 10 pizzas. Yeah. So if you are doing a pizza party, what a great idea if you've got kids or grandkids, right? You're having a birthday party and you're like, we'll go outside, we'll make pizzas for the kids. It'll probably cost you a fraction of what you'd have to pay for them. But you also get the fun of the kids watching. You know, part of the fun is making it. Making it. You know, it. that's what I really like, you know. Yeah. You, everybody is putting their own things on it, people stretch it and. Oh, look at this. Yeah. And there's nothing like making your, look, he's eating his own pizza. There's nothing like making your own huh? pizza. There's a pride in that. If you want yeah. the dough, can we put the dough up? Because we've got a lot of people that want to buy the dough. You get a four pack of the dough, so you can make, what is that? That makes what, four pizzas? Look at that. Right? Another yeah. one, the pepperoni pizza oh here. Oh my gosh. The dough, each bag makes like three. three. Okay, so each bag makes three or four pizzas, so you're gonna get to make, what, that's like 15, 20 pizzas. All right, look at this pie. Marianne, I gotta have a slice of that one. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a pepperoni fan. Can I show everybody the bubbles? Look at the bubbles. Look at this, all right? And I'm just gonna, just to show everybody, I hate to kill the pizza, but I want you to see, when you lift this, this, yeah. is, this is what you want in pizza. Do you see that? Look at that crunch 
all right? And then it's just crust on the bottom. I'll lift it up. I'll try. I've got, I've got chef hands, so, and I want you to see. Look at the char. Yeah. That's what I, that's how I like mine. Yeah, no, no, it's perfect. I love it like yeah. that. Nice and crispy on the bottom. I'm gonna leave this for Marianne. She'll cut it for us and we'll take a slice. Unbelievable, okay. And Do we have a knife here for the steak? Right here. Oh yeah, let's you cut some steak. the steak knife. Well, a big one would be better I so I can slice it. So Wolf, what else yeah. can I, what else would I want to cook in there? Steak? Well, you, you can see we have the vegetable. We have fish, salmon, for example. Ooh. Put a little oregano in here. We have some lemon slices. A little asparagus underneath, and we're gonna put it right in one of our empty ovens here. And it's gonna have that smoky kiss. Yeah. Wow, smoked salmon. Look at that. So if you wanna make, now I don't know if you're gonna be able to make smoked salmon pizza like Wolfgang, but yeah. you could always try. Oh, we're gonna get our smoked <laughs> salmon? All right, look That's at That's how it. I like it. Yeah, perfectly rare for me. Marianne likes it well done, so. Marianne, does. <laughs> do you really like it well done? She does. Done? No, she's just, she says she, you're she does. She said she does, so I don't know. <laughs> I do. <laughs> yeah, I do. That's like when you got married. You said I do. There you go. Now remember, this is a pellet pizza oven, so you're getting the smoke. You see these chimneys? You see the guys back here working the chimneys? They're adding the pellets as we go. If you wanna add more, you can put more. So if you're cooking more pizza, you could do that, but there's nothing to plug in. There's no propane. It's not electric. It works on the heat of the pellets. If you want more, and no lighter fluid, which means none of that crappy lighter fluid taste, which I can't stand. I, I switched over on my smoker. I switched over to, to a, a chunk, a natural charcoal. You know what I use now in my smoker? Pellets. Yeah. Pellets are the best way. They burn better, you get better smoke, yeah. so much easier. Mm -hmm. All know, right, if you wanna get it, 39 bucks gets it home. What else, Wolf? I know, all right, what, should we make more pizza so we have to fish in it, we cook the, the yeah. meat here? I'm gonna come over and take a bite of the pepperoni. Okay, right? yeah. the, kids, the kids love pepperoni, and since you're a big kid, so you eat your <laughs> pepperoni. So I want you to see, I don't know how close you guys can get in here. There it is, okay? Look at the char, all right? You know that guy that rates pizzas? You know what I'm talking about? That's the char right there, all right? And then look at how perfectly it's cooked. It's gonna be hot, so I gotta be a little careful, but. <laughs> yeah, that's all right, that's all right, okay. It's early in the morning, if not, a glass of red wine with it would be perfect. Or like Greg said, a beer. <laughs> oh my gosh. Pizza and beer, not a bad thing Whoa. either. That blows away anything I've ever ordered. I yeah. mean, that is so oh, good. You cannot order and get something like that. No. Not even when you have takeout pizza mm. from Spago. Ah, so good. Wow. All right. Yeah. We're gonna, that pizza's ridiculous. It's so good. Uh, and you know, I didn't prepare myself for, for that much flavor. That is so dang good. If you want to get it, yeah. $1.99. Lowest price anywhere. All Wolf, right. while you're getting ready, they want me to go over and do the offer again. One more okay, time. Okay, do the offer and give everybody a piece of pizza. Who's ready for a slice come of pizza? Come on in, get pizza. All right. Come everybody, come here. on in. <clears throat> all right, while you're doing that, yeah. we're going to get our crew in here because they do an incredible job. And thank you to all my your kitchen crew is amazing. Um, if you want to order today, I'm going to order the black, or you can order the stainless, okay? Black is out selling the stainless five to one in this presentation. Everybody is gonna get the pizza stone. I love the fact that Wolf put the polished side on one side so you can roast vegetables without sticking. You're also gonna get the peel. That's what makes you look like a pizzaiola, right? You got a real peel in there. That way you can feed the pizza in and take it out. You're gonna get the recipe book. We are offering the pellets. The pellets are the key. That's the fuel that you're gonna use. And you can choose apple, oak charcoal, or mesquite hickory charcoal. And all you do is scoop them in and light them up, okay? Just, you, get a, you get a little of that fat wood or whatever, just use one of those. Um, I actually have the little torch and you get it started. Once you get it started, it starts to draw and you get that heat. Within 15 minutes, your oven's gonna be 900 plus degrees, okay? That's what you need to get that crisp. That's what you need to get that smoky taste. Chimney, way to feed it in the back. Get it home. If you try to pick this up separately, $437. That's, that's our retail value. And you're getting the thermometer, $437. If you order it today, it is less than 200. You can break it up into payments of $39. If you wanna get it $50 cheaper, 
We also have an HSN a credit card offer where we'll take $40 off. So this is how it starts, okay? You get your oven on, takes about 10 minutes to get your oven heated up, at the most. And then you get some of Wolfgang's dough. Yeah, you get the dough, you can make the dough at home by hand or with your dough mixer yeah. or with your uh, food processor, whatever you have. Yeah. And what is great, you shape it into balls and then you can freeze it if you want to. Okay. So you can make the dough today, for, form the balls, put them in the freezer, and then when you're ready, take them out the night before in the refrigerator and you're hey, done. Well, if, if, what if I buy a pizza and I want to cook it in the oven? Can I do that too? Yeah, you can I do that I would never too. do that. I know, why, why <laughs> would you do that, yeah. Well, a lot of people in a hurry, they want to feed, they, you know, maybe they got a yeah. leftover and it's frozen. No, but the fun is doing Making it. Making it, You know, know to do I it know. with the family, and you have a whole thing here, like I have vegetables, bacon, mushrooms, whatever you have. Yeah. That's really the fun part. What's this over here? Shrimp. Oh, you're going to make shrimp pizza yeah. too? You can make a <laughs> shrimp pizza. Okay, now here for the kids. Cheese. Plain cheese. Yeah. Now, when there's truffle season at the end, we shave truffles on top, and truffles. then the pizza is 100 bucks. Oh, my God. <laughs> and then, I, hey, have you ever had his smoked salmon pizza? He yeah. puts caviar on that thing. Yeah. And, and, you know, hey, listen. Only limited by your imagination. Look at that fire. Look at that smoke. And then we yeah. put the lid in, and now that's containing it. Within seconds, that temperature jacks back up to eight, 900 degrees. Yeah. I think the, the problem with the regular home oven, it can't get hot enough. It get, never gets hot enough, right? yeah. And just when you get these big pizza stones, you know, it takes them forever to heat up. Yeah. And then it never cooks like that. But it's all about the flavor, you know? Yeah. If you get the pellets have the flavor just like in my pizza oven, and that makes the big difference too. You yeah. get the lightly smokiness, and you get the flavor of a wood-burning thing. It's just like a barbecue, you know? It's so different if you cook something over charcoal or wood fire outside, or you put it just in the oven and boil it, you know? Yeah. So this is what to do. It's, it's pizza making the way it should yeah. be. This is how the professionals do it. They get the hottest oven, uh, they get the best ingredients, and they put it together in a matter of minutes. You know, if you go to Italy, you order a pizza, that thing comes out in five minutes, right? Yeah. Because they have those super hot ovens. Ex wow, look at the salmon. Wow, look at that. Oh, thank you, Dan. Look at that beautiful <laughs> roasted salmon. Oh my gosh. It's perfectly cooked. Yeah. Look at that. That roasting pan's available, by the way. We'll put up the item number for that. I suggest that you get that to go along with your pizza. Yeah. Now, you could have that as a regular dinner. Yeah. Or you could flake that. You could make a smoked salmon salad. You could do so many things. Yeah. What's yeah. this? This is a cod, a miso marinated cod. So we're gonna put that in the oven too. Which one is empty? Oh, oh my pizza here, look at that. Look at that cheese. Yeah. Look at this. Oh my gosh, your kids are gonna it's flip. So <laughs> it's so quick. Look at that, almost done. <laughs> so quick. Look at that. Yeah, I leave it for another minute yeah. and that's it. So listen, get it. You're gonna absolutely love it. $39.99 is all you'll pay to get it home. I encourage you to try it out. I know you're gonna love this. It's gonna add a whole new dimension to your cooking experience. If you like to get together with friends and family, you know, if you think a barbecue is fun, try, try a pizza barbecue. I know. That's gonna uh, be fun. Amazing. It's yeah. amazing. You put that in, a, in your backyard, you have a barbecue, you don't even need it. You have one or the other, you turn this one on. Yeah. You can put your steak in there, your vegetables in there, your fish in there, and Everybody loves pizzas. I know Spago is open for 41 years. Yeah. Oh, I saw it on TV here. Yeah. I don't see many pizza places going out of business. Let's yeah. just, and even the ones that don't have very good pizza. I know. Right? <laughs> Look at that. Look at how plain perfect cheese that pizza. Is. Oh my goodness. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. If you've got kids or grandkids, have fun with them. These are the kind of things that you can do. You can make a whole day of it. It's a Sunday. Hey, kids, come on over. Let's have a pizza party. Yeah. And all you need is just some fresh ingredients. I would encourage you to get Wolfgang's dough and the pellets because you're going you're gonna to want the dough and you're going to need the pellets. So you might as well get them with us. We have a couple of different. Uh, flavors of pellets. We've got the hickory, and the, I think we also have the cherry. Uh, you're going to get bags of those enough to last you weeks and weeks and weeks. Those are your choices, either the black or the silver. To Wolf's earlier point, it only weighs about 20 pounds. You can take this thing anywhere you I go. I know, you can put it anywhere, and the feet fold down up, so yeah. that way you can put it in the trunk of your car. If you go to the beach or wherever there's a barbecue place, yeah. it's easy. So you can be 
your own pizza chef from now on. And you know, from kids to grown-ups, who doesn't like a good pizza? Who doesn't like a pizza made freshly, freshly out of the oven? So there's nothing better. All right. Very busy. Sorry, I'm eating pizza. Very, very busy. So if you want to order, here's how you do it. See that number down there? 822-507. That's the item number. If you're ordering online, using the old school phone way, whatever, give us that number. We'll get it for you. If you want to do it easier, that code down there is called a QR code. That means quick response. Take your phone out, turn on the camera, and just hold the camera in front of that little image. It takes you right to hsn.com. You can order. Order it in black. Order it in stainless. I'm gonna get the black, okay? I just think, I just like the two-tone kind of look to it. Comes with your oven door, obviously. This is removable. It comes with the grate, which is, you have one side which is nonstick, polished, and the other side which is for the pizza. You get the pizza peel so that you can slide your pizzas in and out and serve them out to your guests. That is included. <clears throat> and we're also giving you the recipe book to go along with it. Here's the pellets. Mesquite hickory charcoal in the back or apple, and oak and apple charcoal in the front, scoop of those in the back, light it up, you're good to go. You can also order the dough. We have a, <laughs> just knocked it down in the hole there. Uh, we have a, uh, a four pack of the dough. Each one makes what, three to four pizzas, did you say, Greg? Three to four pizzas in each yeah. one of those? Okay. Yeah, so you get to, you, you make a whole boatload of pizzas. I recommend you get the dough because what's gonna happen is you're gonna get this machine and then you're gonna struggle finding a good dough. You're gonna try to make it yourself. Let Wolfgang help you. He knows what he's doing. So, all right. Absolutely true. It's so easy, you know, when you do it at home and you can make the dough in advance. You don't have to make it at the last moment. You have a little time. You say, okay, pizza dough time. You make it, freeze it, put it in the refrigerator. And when you're ready to make pizzas, you do just like what I do. So if you are a novice at it, what you can do also is use a rolling pin like I have here and you can roll it with that. So just be sure to have enough flour on it. Yeah. And you roll it out. See that? Perfect. Yeah, it's a little, I mean, that's a, a little bit easier way to do it. Yeah. I kind of like the way you do it. I like, <laughs> I like to be like a pizza guy and toss it All up there right. a little bit. But you know, some people might get nervous. Sure. But look how easy it is. Just with the back of my hand. Yeah. See that? And you know you have a good dough, right? Because it's not puncturing. And you yeah, don't, don't and you rush see this how part. nice it stretches. Yeah, look at this. It's nice and thin, Wolf. Yeah. Wow. So you, you can make it as thin as you want. Look when are that. you going to make me a shrimp pizza? All right, I'll make you a <laughs> shrimp pizza. Okay. <laughs> I see the shrimp out there. I'm like, well, listen, Wolfgang is the one that, the legend that started it all with his smoked salmon pizza, which is the most amazing thing. Uh, I remember that was back in the 80s at Spago, yeah, right? The is that 80s. Yeah, you know, one time. How old are we, Wolf? Joan Collins came for dinner. <laughs> yeah. And she used to love our smoked salmon, but I never made a smoked salmon pizza. And then we ran out of bread. Okay. So what I did, I did I said, are this ready? <laughs> okay, so I put a pizza disc like that in the oven and served yeah. it to here. And then at the end, I said, okay, I'm going to put it all together. And you know what? I tasted it. I said, all I need is a glass of wine or a glass <laughs> of champagne, and yeah. it was perfect. Isn't that amazing how things okay, start, so you know? Shrimp and pesto go really well together. Okay. So you can put it on the bottom or on the top. So let's put a little cheese. Okay. And remember, experiment, have fun. Exactly, you it, can put on whatever you want. This is a party machine when you think about it. This is a thing to go glass, grab a glass of wine, grab a beer, iced tea, lemonade with your kids, whatever it is, and let them design their own pizza. Ex I wouldn't let the kids near the pizza oven. It's very hot until they're old enough where you can trust that. So make sure you, you, you never leave that oven unattended, but just grab whatever it is that you need. So we've got, look at that. We chopped up some shrimp. Yeah, marinated, it marinated. with a little jalapenos Ooh, and wolf. a little garlic i can't wait for this one. Oh my gosh okay and again whatever you've got maybe you got some mushrooms what is pizza in the uh, you know in the, in the fridge you could even i've had i've actually sampled like potato and cheese pizza that's good yeah so you can make any type of pizza that you want 39 dollars will deliver this to your door you'll get it in about a week and all you got to do is just put the pellets in light it yeah bring it outside remember it is an outdoor pizza oven and start to have fun right create traditions Yep. You don't have to be Italian to love pizza, right? Anybody Everybody. loves pizza. Everybody. Pizzas are famous all over the world. Oh you my know, gosh. Look whatever. At how... A little mushroom, a little bacon, and some shrimp. That's pretty. Look at how beautiful. Yeah. Where do you see it come out of the oven? So we'll show you again how it works. Okay. Thank you, Marianne. Look at that. Come right here for your sea bass. 
Uh -huh. Your sea bass is okay. ready, right there. Okay, look at that. We slide it right off, and that's it. Put Close it up, on. and yep. don't forget it. Yeah. Okay, take it out, Marianne. All right, uh, Marianne, what you got there? The sea bass that's marinated with miso. Oh, my. Look. Gosh. Wolf, what do you look at this? And, and in, look, this yeah. is you in a week when you and get you this never, home. The only thing you did as far as as far as agitate, you just have to watch it. You, you have to rotate everything. So yeah, just give yeah. it a little flip yeah. once in a while so it cooks even yeah. because you remember, you want that fire to hit everything. Look at that. Is that just the bread? Yeah, that's just bread with <laughs> oh, a little parmesan on it. Look at this. I got to try this cheese pizza. All right. So this, I'll do this for my son. He's a cheese pizza fan. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't, I can't tell you enough how incredibly satisfying that is. Well, you know what, because most people in their lives, have, unless they go to a pizza place, they don't get fresh pizza out of no, the oven. Uh, absolutely right? not. And for me, it's really the making it, you have fun doing it. Yeah. And you know, families who cook together stay together. You know, as a child, our biggest memories are for the holidays, because so for Thanksgiving, we all sit together and have a feast and eat. Now you can yeah. have a pizza party, you know, it's better funny. than anywhere. When I watch you, and you, I know you talk about your boys all the time, yeah. uh, and it's all, a lot of it, it goes around food. Yeah, exactly. Right? And then yeah. you teach them to cook, and then, they, you know, that's that's the fun way to do, be able to do it, but you have to have the right appliances. I'm telling you, get this thing home. You have 30 days to try it out. You're going to absolutely love it. I'm dying to see this shrimp pizza. $39 is all it will cost you to get home your very first pizza oven. All right, you're gonna love it. Simplicity, weighs around 20 pounds. Take it to the beach, take it to the park, yeah. take it to a friend's house, have a pizza party. Exactly, you yeah. can do it and it's so easy to do. You don't have to be a chef, you don't have to be anything. Look at that, no. how many pizzas did we make here? <laughs> Crazy. Ah, uh, one, two, three, four, five. You've probably made a dozen pizzas, yeah. all right? The wings are ready. And we made wings. Okay, take them out. Fish. Oh my gosh, and the fish is ready. It's all ready. Marianne, and because Greg likes the chicken wings, what do you yeah. put on a little barbecue, barbecue sauce, sauce or what? <laughs> Here, a little barbecue sauce. Hey, look did, at it. Did you guys cook, did you cook those in the, you cooked those in the pan? In, in yeah. the iron skillet, yeah. Okay, check it out. You think you've had wings before? We really have smoky oh my pizza gosh. oven wings. Oh, right. It doesn't get better than that. Oh, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that is awesome. I won't take a bite out of your hand, I promise. If you want to get it, guys, we have two minutes left. Let me show you your colors. You can order it in stainless steel, or you can order it in the modeled black. Everybody gets the pizza stone, reversible. Everybody gets the pizza peel. You'll also get the, the uh, uh, outdoor pizzeria um, pellet oven recipe book that also gives you the instructions. If you want to pick up pizza dough, I got a four pack of that. Each one of these boxes makes about three or four pizzas. I would get this in a second, all right? Also, the pellets, they come in uh, mesquite or they come in the uh, oak apple, okay? So mesquite is hickory, mesquite hickory, and then oak apple combo. So, and remember, you can buy pellets anywhere. I'd, I'd like you to get some here just so you have them because I know once you get this thing home, you're gonna wanna use it. So make sure that you do that. You're gonna absolutely love it. Here's the fish. Yeah. I mean, the fish, look at that, how flaky. Flaky. I love the, t the little cherry tomatoes, too. With the roasted cherry yeah. tomatoes, it's so good. Wings. Wings. I mean, Cheese look pizza. At, look at our shrimp pizza. We just put it in the yeah, oven. Yeah, is, it, is this the shrimp? Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, pull that guy out. <laughs> Mary Ann, look out. Here comes the shrimp pizza. <laughs> All right. Look at that. Here, Wolf, oh I'll, I'll move this, okay? Okay, now look at that. All right. That is spectacular. Look at that. Do you mind if I put a little grated cheese on top of it? Yeah, like a, little, a little parmesan on top. A little parmesan on top, on yes, top uh, Wolf, because I think that's going to, look at this. Yeah. All right. Here we go. You're all right, do, if you like, it? you can also yeah, yeah, a yeah, little do that. Pest, a little pesto on top. So it's all up to your imagination. You can make it plain like we have here, or you can make it with uh, shrimp, with pepper, whatever you like. Look at this, guys. Wolf, you are a master. Look at this. And you know you can do this. Yeah. And by the way, you're going to get better at it totally. the more you do it. Exactly. Look at this, look at this Be pizza. Be careful, it's very hot. I know. Look at this. That is a beautiful slice of pizza. Yeah. And it's gourmet. Yeah. And you know what? You bought, you, you bought some, you know, you on can, sale shrimp and yeah. that's you, it. You can go to the farmer's market, pick up some vegetables or just in your produce department, a little basil. You can even get plants like that at home.